No, this Prayashit Diksha is some kind of desecration. Uh, continuously, it's happening for the last few years, last five, six years. And around 219 temples were desecrated. And in Ramathir, the Lord Rama statue was, uh, uh, head was chopped off. So this is not just about one prasad issue today. Maybe it came out. Maybe this was the triggering point uh, to initiate all this. Prayashit Diksha is the commitment for to take forward the Sanatana Dharma, Parirakshana board is very essential. That is the art of the day. This kind of occurrences, any kind of desecration to temples and such kind of occurrences should be stopped and should be addressed at differently, at a different level. And all this, uh, I mean, keeping all this in my mind, and I think that's what I initiated this diksha. This is going to be, I think, at uh, tenth day. Uh, once I'm uh, done with this, tomorrow we're going to have a, a declaration. Uh, day after, what we are going ahead, uh, um, what we are looking at. It is not just about uh, it's not just about uh, saying something and we're forgetting it. There should be some kind of permanent to this, or some permanent uh, addressing mechanism to it. I think uh, that's what we're going to unleash. Uh, uh, that's what the roadmap which we would like to uh, set on uh, day after tomorrow. I think they said in such a way it was, uh, no, they never said it was not ad uh, adulterated. Maybe whatever information they have on their hands, I think they commented on that. And the Honorable uh, Supreme Court uh, judges said it was, uh, they didn't say it was unadulterated. They said, uh, regarding the date, there was a confusion which will be cleared. And that is one aspect. Uh, but um, it's a later, I think our, state, our government will do, will take it forward. Like, you know, how many, what kind of uh, violations happened in the last five years? It's not just about a Prasad issue.